How's it going guys? Welcome back to another Gutter Zone Vlogs. Today is Thursday. How's it going guys? <laughs> and uh, we are back home. Vacations are over. I wanna go back. We, we went back to work. Vacations are over. It sucks. <laughs> and we're burnt. Dude, I, I think I'm peeling. I don't know. If, I don't know if it's gonna be able to catch it, but I think I'm like peeling already. And we were back. We we came back on Monday, uh, but the internet was really slow over there. And then uh, I, I like I said, I was just enjoying my vacation. That I didn't really edit too much over there, which is why videos went up. What was it? Wednesday and today, Thursday. I'm trying to convince my to get this. Yeah, so uh, I know one of our friends has this, and I know uh, Christelle's been actually looking at it for a while now, too. Like it's called for, months. for a couple of weeks at least. Um, months? Month. About month, a month, month? Something like that. It's called Flavor God. One of the, one of the things that we want to do um, now that summer's over, <laughs> I know, right? It's kind of like backwards. Now that summer's over, what we want to do is kind of eat healthier um, and. Uh, you know, work out. I guess what what that is, the flavor guide is just seasoning, right? Kind of healthier yeah. seasoning or like they're fresh. Fresh they're season. I don't know. So I don't know. She's looking into it. Good. She's looking into it, and but she gets sold on things very very quickly. <laughs> I research I and I get down to it. I'll start looking for reviews <laughs> and I'll start like that. She's like, oh, it's twenty bucks. Bye. Why not? <laughs> I'm like, I get I get deep into the thing. Hey. She wants to go to Joanne's real quick. I think she wants to pick up some things that she wants to do for her next video. We want to be more prepared, uh, which is why we want to stop filming on Sundays and maybe move it up to maybe Fridays or Saturdays. Uh, just so uh, we have a little bit more time. I think I, I'm, I'm not liking these uh, filming and editing the same days type of things. Uh, I feel like it's very stressful. <laughs> On both parts, so we're gonna we're trying to get a head start on things and you know and, uh, and do that. So we're gonna probably head out to Joanne's before it gets too late. But like I said, we are back. Uh, we've barely unpacked. We've been back since Monday, but we knocked out Monday. We knocked out Tuesday, and all of yesterday, all of Wednesday, uh, we were filming and editing for her channel. So it's been a weird couple of days. Oh, by the way. Uh, on Monday, uh, it was about a, it's it's technically supposed to be from Las Vegas to Rocky Point. It's supposed to be about a seven to eight hour drive, eight hour at the most. I'm gonna say right. Yeah. At the most eight hours because when we went to when when we went that way, it was about a three and a half hour drive to Phoenix and then another maybe three and a half hours to uh, Rocky Point from Phoenix to Rocky Point. Uh, so it was nothing. But on our way back. It was Labor Day weekend. It was a holiday. We went, we came back around 10, 11 a.m. Traffic was ridiculous in Mexico. Ridiculous. I didn't. I, I don't think we filmed that. I was driving. I, I was driving the first half. Then Michelle was driving the other half. But the traffic was ridiculous. Oh, uh, to cross over to the United States, uh, it had to do a lot with the border. And there was, and there was a lot of stations. There was a lot of lines open. There was probably at least like five of them, maybe. How many did you see, Crystal? Maybe five of them. For being that the, the small border that we crossed, because we didn't cross like a TJ one or, or you know, something. TJ is like, they got like a million lines, you know, because uh, they know they have traffic a lot. But uh, this one, they had like five lanes open. And, uh, you know, the, 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 the security was ridiculous. And so it took us forever to cross over. It took us three hours to cross over that first, the, to cross over the border. And then it took us another 45 minutes, 30, 45 minutes yeah. to cross the second checkpoint. They, they, have, a, they have another checkpoint where, where, again, they check your, you know, your, 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 you know, your, your passport and all that stuff. Um, and, then, uh, there, and then there's a third checkpoint where they check it again, maybe like another, maybe like another 30 minute drive down, an hour drive down. That one we were there maybe for 15 minutes. So it all added up to be close to four hours of just waiting in line. So a seven hour trip turned into about a 10 to 11 hour trip. Um, so that's why we didn't get back home to Vegas about 9 p.m. At that point we came home, washed clothes, uh, had some quick dinner and knocked 
out because uh, we have to go to we have to go to work the next day. Um, so that was quite an adventure. I think if anything, I learned not to go to Rocky Point during a holiday, and uh, maybe 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 come back a little earlier and not under and not underestimate the lines because the border lines can get crazy, like crazy packed. Yeah. So that's probably a lesson that we're gonna take for next time we go. But I was telling her I felt comfortable. I liked it. Uh, it was a lot of fun. We're definitely gonna have to do that again, especially since she has family over there. Uh, we're definitely gonna have to do that again. Um, you know, probably in the next year or so. Yeah, and Elias buying tortillas. <laughs> yeah, no, it was funny because so so yeah yeah it was funny because so while you're waiting in line, you're in the Mexico side, um, which is cool. No no big deal. There's a lot of people. There was a lot of Americans, a lot of people from Phoenix, a lot of people from Arizona and California, and Texas. a few from Nevada, Texas, Colorado. We saw a lot of them like all over the place. Yeah. Uh, so so it's jam packed with thousands of car American cars ready to go back crossover so they can uh, you know uh, cross over on a Monday get ready to go to work back on Tuesday but you know um, you know you're waiting in line in Mexico so what happens is that uh, there's people there's a lot of people posted up selling stuff uh, which is great because we bought during that point, we brought uh, we bought her little sister, Crystal's little sister Izzy. We yeah. bought her an emoji uh, uh, pillow, which ended up costing me about maybe seven American dollars, yes. which is not bad. So yeah, so that's why we bought that. Elias, he brought he bought tortillas. He bought uh, it was about a dozen. He bought four packs. Uh, but it, he he what was it, Crystal? He ended up like talking to about four or five different people to see how me what what the good deal because they, they weren't they weren't just one tortilla lady. There was like. There's like 30 tortilla ladies, yeah. you know, he so he was, was like, he was like, he was trying to make deals. He was trying to hustle them and say, hey, you know what? This other lady's giving me 10 in a pack. And so he ended up getting like 12 in a pack and he bought four packs, something like yes. that. Uh, and he bought and he, it was like, so it was like over 40 tortillas, Yeah. about over 40 tortillas, right? Yeah. Over 40 tortillas for about four bucks. Like 48 tortillas. 48 tortillas, something like that for about $4. Uh, and, and handmade, so it's always, they're always good when they're handmade. What else did we get? Uh, we I think eating. Michelle bought a, a little bag for, for their daughter. Yeah. Uh, we were eating tortillas. We were eating way. tortillas. <laughs> well, I'm like saying, what do you do when you're waiting in line the border for three and a half hours? You, you're, you know, whatever people are selling, you're eating. So, so it's, it's, it's funny that they're selling it because you, you see people selling tacos and and people you know you know people that are waiting in line they're like screw it i'm gonna put my car on 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 uh i'm parking and i'm gonna get down and get me some tacos <laughs> people buying tacos people buying ice cream you know uh from these people that are just selling it you know that they, they're uh you know uh, tens and tens of miles that we had to wait uh and people were just walking down there and saying hey you know you want you want some tortillas we're selling tortillas you want some ice cream we're selling ice cream you want some tacos we're selling tacos uh, you want some uh, souvenirs? We're selling souvenirs, Mexican souvenirs. So I thought that was uh, hilarious, but also convenient because we did end up eating some tortillas and, uh, you know, and ended up getting some gifts, last minute gifts that we needed to get too. They so, good. yeah, they were good. So that ended up being very convenient. Uh, but yes, that was our story from uh, crossing the border and getting our way back. And now we're home. We missed it. We missed our bed. I missed it. Yeah. But let's go. I, we've been blabbing for like a long time, but we just had stories. Yeah. We had a lot of stories. And, uh, funny stories too. Huh? Funny stories. Fun, too. Funny stories too that we just wanted to kind of get them out of there. Because uh, I thought they were funny. But let's but head out. I forgot to block me driving. Oh, yeah. So <laughs> another little story, quick story. Uh, so we all, took turns, we all took turns in that, in that four-wheeler. Um, but uh, one, I was so small. But one of them that we didn't get that I didn't record was Chriselle's. I never, <laughs> I didn't record hers because we were holding on for dear life. <laughs> I think we couldn't move the seat, so she had trouble reaching the brakes. Yeah, I couldn't reach it. I was just like scratching there. She was <laughs> yeah. She had to like kind of like kneel down to reach it. So so she she did a Wait. turn. And we literally almost tipped over the car and started. Nah, well, Michelle almost fell from the car. 
Yeah, but it wasn't like that. It wasn't like that. All right, so she didn't. She couldn't the, break. The car just like um, hit a bump, like a big bump of dirt, and that's why Michelle was falling out. And you well, were she drifted. Out. Like she, we we're like, oh, let's go back and turn. She couldn't reach the brakes too much to brake harder. I so we ended up, there. we ended up drifting and almost, almost tipped over. But uh, really, this was the brake, and it was my feet like this. <laughs> but we thought that was funny. She almost killed us there. Well, not killed us, but you know, nah. we probably would have got some scrapes. <laughs> but uh, that's what happens when you're small. You can't reach the brakes. <laughs> but uh, that was a funny story. I, yeah, I didn't vlog. I was like holding on to dear life. I was like, screw this. <laughs> Same thing happened with the with the banana ride. Like I was, I tried at the beginning, and I was like, no, nah, I care. I care more about me not falling off in the ocean because I'm terrified of the ocean than freaking getting GoPro footage. So I told my buddy Elias and he was like, I'll do it, whatever. So he did it, so. so uh, thank you Elias for making it happen. Yeah, we were able to get two cool GoPro footages for the banana ride because he was like, screw it. <laughs> <laughs> if I fall, I fall. That's pretty much what he was thinking. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, that's what happens and we're back home. We gotta go take care of these things because we gotta come back and pick up a lot of stuff. Um, we gotta pick up our lights because we were filming yesterday, cameras that we have laying down because we were editing er all the footage that we had. Uh, we have to come pick that up because tomorrow, oh, yeah, the kitchen, look at the kitchen. Do not in my kitchen. I couldn't see it, you actually <laughs> blocked it. The kitchen because tomorrow, um, because uh, Christelle's little sister's birthday was on Sunday, but we were in Mexico, so we didn't celebrate her. And uh, they all agreed that we're going to celebrate her tomorrow on Friday. Friday after work, uh, we're all going to come get some cake. She's going to invite some friends over. Yeah, so we're going to celebrate her tomorrow here at, here at our house. So I at least, I at least, I know her mom, your mom's going to come over while we're at work, huh? She said, yeah. I think her mom's going to come over and clean while we're at work. But I was like, you know what? I got to clean at least my, my junk, you know, my cameras, my, my uh, lights and all that stuff. Because I don't want her to worry about, you know, moving that and stuff like that yeah so we got to come back and clean so let's go let's go take care of them some yeah, stuff I, we've been, i've been blabbing for like 18 minutes i'm probably have to cut a bunch of it off yeah all right so all the stores were closed we're back home <laughs> we went to michael's we went to hobby lobby went to joanne's they were all closed and it, uh, was your fault. it was my fault it was definitely my fault i took too long that's why um, and then I started talking for like 20 minutes. <laughs> and it was funny because it was 7, it was 7.30 and I was like, I'm ready. And he's like, yeah, 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 five minutes, five minutes. And he pulled it out until 9.15. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I was busy, okay. Yeah. I was busy. But, uh, we got dinner, we got some carne asada fries that we're gonna share. And, uh, and yeah, and get ready for tomorrow. Clean up a little bit. All right, so we're done cleaning. It's looking better. It's looking better. We cleaned a lot of stuff over here too. So it's looking a lot better. Uh, I took my computer upstairs now. Finally, I took the computer upstairs. Uh, this looks a lot cleaner. Uh, still a lot of things to do, but it looks so much more clean. Here it looks cleaner. Uh, dining room table looks cleaner. The kitchen's a mess, but I think Chris and her mom will take care of that tomorrow. Um, but yes, we are done, finally. Now I gotta edit this vlog and go to sleep because we went to sleep way too late yesterday editing her video, so, um, yeah, I think we're done. Tomorrow, we're gonna celebrate uh, my sister-in-law's birthday, Chriselle's little sister, Captain Izzy. She turned, well, she turned 14 already, so tomorrow we're gonna be celebrating her birthday. Uh, with her friends and family and stuff like that. We're gonna all hang out here. Something small, but you know, something good for her. Something good, you know, at least to celebrate and stuff like that. So that's what we'll do tomorrow. Uh, but for now, we are done. We're done with this vlog. We'll be back tomorrow for another Good Zone Vlogs. Uh, so I think I'm done. See you guys. Peace. Bye. Shh.